हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ डेवलपर्स एंड कोडर्स क्लब एन आई टी अगतला टूडे वी विल डिस्कस कोड पोर्स इज राउंड एट नाइन्टी थ्री डिविजन टू फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम बटन लेट्स टेक अ लुक एट द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट एना एंड कैटी एंडेड अप इन अ सीक्रेट लेबोरेटरी देर आर ए प्लस बी प्लस सी बटन इन द लेबोरेटरी ए बटन कैन बी ओनली प्रेस्ड बाय एना बी बटन कैन बी ओनली प्रेस्ड बाय कैटी एंड सी buttons can be pressed by either of them anna and katy decided to play a game taking turns pressing these button anna makes the first turn each button can be pressed at most once so at some point one of the girls will not be able to make her turn the girl who cannot press a button loses determine who will win if both the girls play optimally so let's see what the code is trying to say so uh, we are given here three inputs a b and c okay where a buttons can be pressed by anna b by katy and c either both of them anna and katy okay so uh, let's take an example as If a is equals to one and b is equals to two, and let's say c is equals to zero, so how we are going to start? Will first like first move will be done by Anna, so a will become zero, and in Katie's turn, b will become one. Now for Anna, no such button is left, so automatically Katie wins in the second one. Let's say when a is equals to two and b is equals to one, so uh, what will happen for Kate? Anna's move first, a is equals to one, and for Katie's move, b is equals to zero. Now again in second one when Anna will play, then a will equals to zero, and for uh, Katie there will be no extra move. So what will happen? Anna will win, which is the first person will win. so basically from here what we observe that when a is greater than b first one will win and when b is greater than a second one will win okay but what if a is equals to b so in this scenario let's, let's see what will happen when a is equals to b so then we'll check c okay so let's say if c is equals to 2 then uh, what will happen let's start with anna then katy then no other move will be left for anna so katy wins okay and if c is equals to 3 so let's start with anna katy anna and nothing will be left for katy so automatically Anna will win. So from here, what we observe when C is even, Katy will win, and when C is odd, Anna will win. So let's see how the code looks like. We'll first take the input of test cases, A, B, C integers. When a is greater, first will be get printed. B is greater, second. If both are equal, we'll check odd even condition. When odd, first will be get printed, and when even, second will get printed. Let's run this. So that's it. Thank you.